Hello, good morning. Charang. <laughs> hey guys, so it's me, Shilan Beaches. So welcome back again to my YouTube channel. Okay, so for this video, guys, today I'll be doing a another first impression review of the new product that I encountered last time and some all you know encountered ko na I think this is the cheapest price that I ever encountered in my life kasi you know what pag nakita mo yung pressure di ka talaga magdadalawang istabilihin siya okay so yes our ating review for today is all about the crayons BB cream so this is the base foundation na available for 89 pesos sa HBC yes you heard it right, it costs like 89 pesos only. Ang nakakalungkot lang guys pala dito sa BB cream na to is it comes with two shades only. I think you fair light at saka natural beauty. Ito lang yung nakita kong shade. Actually, yung shade ng natural beauty is a little bit darker. I don't know on my skin pero yung isang fair naman is too much. I mean, it's too light for me like yung too much pigmentation na when it comes to pink undertone kaya ito kasi is more on yellow undertone yellow na may pagka peachy undertone okay so without further ado guys let's play my intro <laughs> So, medyo na curious lang ako. Sabi ko, why not na i-compare ko siya sa another drugstore makeup or local brand na makeup na this one is a little bit expensive for me. I mean, yes, it is a local brand or drugstore makeup. Pero, <clears throat> guys, this one is a little bit this one is a little bit expensive compared to my other drugstore makeup. Kasi ito, from LA Girl Pro Mod, it costs like 800 pesos. And this one is 89. So, doon pala sa presyo, malaki na kanyang difference. So, we'll see how it works on my skin. Uh, right side, I'm going to use a crayons BB cream from the HBC, new lineup from the HBC. And then, here on the left side, of, on my face, I'm going to use a LA Girl Pro Matte. Uh, I'm in the shade medium beige and it costs 800 pesos. Okay, so I'm done to prep my face. So, next is I'm going to read description of this product before we start to our application craze bb cream or craze beauty balm with sun protection conceals imperfections smoothens and even skin tone that gives you a fresh bright and radiant skin so ibig sabihin meron siyang um sort of spf or sun protection which is good kasi we all know sa pilipinas mainit talaga panahon sa atin and Meron siyang 0.85 fluid ounce or 25 ml. What I like to this product is first, as if from affordable, I think um, for me approved na yung size nung, or, yung, uh, or yung ideal nung laman ng product. Kasi 89 pesos lang siya guys. It is very 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 cheap. And then, manufacturer date 2019, expiration 2021. So, ibig sabihin, Kahit hindi mo pa siya buksan, nag-run nag na yung expiration niya. So, meron, uh, meron pa siya 2 years lifespan. So, yes. Okay. So, very very basic ang kanyang packaging, no? Nasa tube. Tapos, na, meron na siyang sealed like this. And, and then, ayun, meron siyang another sealed dito. Naririnig yun? Malamang hindi. Ako naririnig. Okay. Definitely, this foundation is very, very, very liquidy. Kasi medyo watery yung nasa loob. Pero tinan natin. Zoom in ko lang kayo. There you go. Hello. Okay, so. Not to run, not to tick. So, big sabihin, Oh, sakto lang and I have a doubt on the sh I have a doubt on my shade. I think it's kind of darker. I don't know. It is kind of dark on my skin. 
I don't see how it works. Okay, so, hindi na ako na primer. So, ang ginamit ko lang is moisturizer. And then, I'm going to use a damp sponge. Actually, this is a microfiber sponge. Damp to guys, ha? Damp. Okay, so this is the close-up. Of course, my face. So, there you go. Welcome to my face. Okay, so right now, what I encountered to my face or my skin condition right now is first, there's a lot of, you know, bumps or dark spots that I have there. Mga masalimutan nakaraan that I have a lot of redness that is actually picking through on my here on my chin and then on the side of my mouth and on the other side of my nose as well. So let's start. Hey, look at that. Mm. The coverage. Wait, yeah. All right. The shade is very, very, actually not bad. And I can definitely say the coverage of the foundation is up to medium coverage. Guys, gumamit ako ng microfiber sponge, ha? Ito, hindi siya masyadong nag-absorb. So, automatically, maglalagay talaga siya ng medium. But eventually, here on this part, on my nose, so, yan, makikita talaga dyan, na, nandyan pa yung, um, nandyan pa yung bakas ng mga tigyawat ko. And, I think, ang coverage is sheer up to medium coverage. Okay guys, it's raining, I know. So ito yung meron, at saka yung, ito yung wala. It doesn't feel lightweight, talaga masabi mo meron kang nakalagay sa mukha. So, two layers lang ginawa ko ha, to build the coverage here on the side of my face, especially here on the part of my nose, and the finish is um, not 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 dewy. I don't know. Meron siyang lagkit na I don't know. Nito transfer sa kamay ko yung uh, BB cream. I think kailangan siyang iset kagad kasi Yung adhesive niya sa face ko, hindi ganun ka-okay. I know, nalagyan na stain. Nung ginawa ko siya nalagyan na stain ng mga foundation. So, big sabihin, hindi, hindi siya ganun ka-adhesive sa aking face. Pasok siya sa dewy finish. In my own opinion, pasok siya sa dewy finish category. Pero shade not bad. It looks so natural on my face. Yun. So, gawin ko na muna yung aking left side with the use of LA Girl Pro Matte. Alright. And this is the LA Girl Pro Matte Foundation. Well, definitely, mas maganda yung finish ni um, uh, LA Girl Pro Matte. Tapos binigyan din niya ako ng instant uh, medium up to full coverage. So, dito, hindi na ako nag-build up ng coverage. Kung ano yung pinasadahan ko, yun na yun. And, so, totoo lang, at, dit, uh, ngayon ko na nare-realize kung bakit minsan mas okay tayong mag-invest sa mga good makeup kahit na medyo may kamahalan ko pero sa mga mura. Okay, first is yung finish. This is way better than this. Mas, mas smooth itong part na to compare dito kasi dito, it looks rough. 
And yung akin pores ay na-emphasize niya ako. So, wala lang ito sa camera kasi sa ganda yung zoom ko, ano? Okay. So, I don't know kung nakikita niyo. So, I'm a textured skin here. And then, on this part, talaga makikita mo na may glow. I know. Kumiki nang siya, which is, kung kayo ay oily skin, definitely you're not gonna like this one. Dito sa part na to, guys, is a lot of pores that actually getting, ano, is getting bigger. Or, kasi, the reason, the reason is, na-emphasize nga niya yung ating mga pores compared to this one. This one is clear na clear. It is very smooth. Yung pores na minimize naman niya o hindi naman niya napalala. And the finish is matte. Definitely a matte finish foundation or a powder finish. And this is looks so natural. When it comes to, let's talk about the shade. This is better or more natural compared to this one because this one it gives it can give me a what we call the white cast a little bit because of the sun protection yung kanya formulation kasi meron siya sun protection that's why it has a white cast compared to this one and this one is very 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 yellow undertone that's why it can that's why it suits on my skin and it really blends so natural on my skin Okay, so time check. It is now already a 7, um, 41 na ng umaga. And I'm going to finish first my full face makeup and I'll be right back. Alright, so I'm done with my full face makeup. So after na ang full face makeup for today. So it is now already, um, it is now already 8.14 na ang nakalipas. So, I think nasa 20 minutes na rin ang nakalipas nung uh, in-apply ko yung makeup sa aking face or yung base, uh, base rather. So, zoom ko kayo. Alright, so right now, this, ito yung um, BB, uh, B, Crayons BB Cream. Ayan, nung nag-set ako, mas lalong nagsigawan yung mga pores yung mga butas-butas parang lalo niyo na justify which is I'm not confident na nalabas ng ganito ko I don't know ha we'll see kasi hindi rin ako nag primer kasi I want to test out the product as is so yun isa sa reason nyo ka na mukhang, mukhang kailangan mag primer sa foundation na to at uh, mayroon parang naranatama ng konting lagkit not unlike to this one so this one is, yung pores ko is hindi niya gano'n na-emphasize, still looks good, at uh, maganda yung pagka-blend out ng foundation compared to this one na uh, it looks so, you know, so-so. Uh, pwede na, pero hindi ako impressed sa performance niya as of now, hindi ako impressed compared to this one. Okay. Guys, disclaimer lang ha. This is not the comparison between the BB cream uh, from uh, from HBC up to this LA Girl Pro Matte. So this another purpose of this vlog is I want you to enlighten up about what's the importance of um, investing in makeup sa okay tsaka sa cheaper one. Kasi meron talagang disadvantage at advantage yung mahal at tsaka mura. Kung kayo ay naghahangad ng performance or good performance, definitely, you have to consider the price. And if you're aiming for a budget-friendly, hindi kayo mamaati sa performance, then definitely you go to the cheaper side. So, lalabas ako mamaya, papakita ko sa kanila yung kung ano mas gusto nila. So, hindi ko sabihin dito kung alin yung mga tsaka alin dito yung mura. Okay? So, tignan natin kung paras kami ng paranaw ng mga tao sa labas. So, I'll be right back for my next update. Alright, papakita na natin guys. Tin, sabi na ako sa'yo. Anong mas maganda? Ito o ito? Parang parang? Parang? Parang. Actually, isa dyan, mahal isa dyan mura na foundation. Tinan mo kayo na malapitan. <laughs> Hindi mo ko sa... Ano yung mas smooth, mas okay? Ito, itong left side. Dito, ano problema dito? Ay, ano. Ay, dito? 
Basta para mas makinis yung dito. Mas makinis? Oo, oh, hindi dito. Oo. Oh, oh. Tinamin ulos ko dito. Oh. Ano napansin mo? Hindi natakpan. Okay. Pero ulitin ko ha, din dito, mahal. 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 Hindi dito mura. Ah, si Mama? Wala, umalis. Okay, so... Yung dito daw mas maganda compared to this one kasi ito nga yung LA Girl Pro mat ng 800 pesos tapos dito yung HBC na 89 pesos so sabi nga niya mas smooth daw dito compared to this one kasi ito kasi ito lang medyo splotchy tignan So hi guys, so I came back I'm back So it is now already um, 11.10 na ng umaga and it's been 3 hours na yung nakalipas lagpas 3 hours na yung nakalipas so, tingnan natin kung ano nangyari sa aking face. Hindi pa ako nag-blot, hindi pa ako tumitingin sa salamin ngayon actually sa camera ko ngayon tumitingin sa screen ng aking camera. And my hair looks so mess right now. Wala siya sa kondisyon. So anyway, let's regard that. So, looking at my mirror right now, tingnan natin kung ano nangyari. Alright. Definitely talaga meron silang pinagkaiba when it comes to performance of the product. <clears throat> on this right side, I'm quiet being problematic on this side. You know, there's a lot of happenings on this right side. And dami nangyari compared to this one. A very, very normal, normal as my typical foundation na talagang kasi lang nasa vanity ko or kapag ang isang product nag-remain or nag-stay sa vanity area ko which means Pasok siya sa standard ko, pero pag nakita nyo na nawala siya sa aking vanity area, which means hindi ko siya nagustuhan. Well, to be very honest, I'm currently being problematic na talaga dito sa side na to. Pag malayo, pag malayo ka, I mean, pag malayo ka sa atohanan, um, okay siya. Personally, okay din siya, pero pag yung titingin sa'yo, kapag lumapit talaga, talagang, ano yan, parang gagawin sila sa face mo. Mabuti pa i-zoom na lang kayo para malaman para malaman ninyo uh, para malaman ninyo kung tinutukoy ko na nagiging problemado ako. Okay, so hindi ko alam kung nabibigyan ng justice ng camera yung aking face. Again, welcome back again to my face. Ganyan talaga close. <laughs> so, right now, dito sa part of to nagkikris talaga and I don't really like it so much and then dito nagumpisa na mag uh, mag grease yung foundation or yung BB cream dito sa bandang part na to at nakapasok na yung mga foundation dun sa pores which is very alarming for me kasi hindi ko hinahayaan na mangyari yun sa akin may mo wait lang kasi natin muta And then, here on my eyes, hindi ko alam. Sige, try ko ilapit yung camera. Okay? Nakikita nyo ba? Wait lang. Ayan. See? Kumalat yung makeup compared to this one. Ito yung normal foundation ko, yung LA Girl Pro. Compared to this one, talagang ayun, nag-smudge. Nag-mess up yung eye makeup ko compared to this one. And, hello focus. And then, Ah, uh, ayun, nakikita niyo ba sa ilong ko? Sorry ha, alam, sorry, pero kailangan ko pakita sa inyo to. Ganyan siya magpatsipatsi. And, compared to this one, this one looks um, tolerable compared to this one. I don't really like it so much. I don't know. I know it looks disgusting, guys. Pero gusto ko sila pakita ang katotohanan na nangyayari sa aking mukha. Okay, try natin ngayon mag -blot. Okay. Pero pakita ko na din pala, nakalimutan ko ano. Okay. Kung may nalilin din kayo, huwag nyo napansinin. Ayan, nakita nyo? Nagkikris itong part na to. Dito wala. Hmm? Smooth. Wala akong nakikita problema. Dito talaga, ayan no? Hmm? See in lines? Nagbumuha akong matanda lalo sa BB cream. Kasi, usually pag BB cream, ah, uh, usually pag BB cream nga to make you look, you know, younger, ganyan. Okay, so, hi, hi. 
Now you feel me. Kung bakit ako nagiging problematic sa, sa right side na to. So try kong mag-blot. So ito, si um, LA Girl Pro. At tapos ito si BB, I mean Crayons BB Cream na base. Obviously, when it comes to oil control, very average si... Um, what you call that si BB Crayons BB Cream compared to this one. Ito, hindi niya nakalahati. O let's say nakalahati lang niyang... Uh, ma-occupied yung um, blotting paper compared to this one na halos na puno. So, definitely when it comes to oil control talaga, um, LA Girl Pro still get the um, the, um, the standard for my face. Okay, so thanks for watching guys. I hope na nakatulong sa inyo itong video na ito. And please don't forget to subscribe on my channel. But to give me a thumbs up and don't forget also to click the ring bell icon so you can be notified whenever I upload a new video like this. Also, forget to follow me also on my social media account and see you on my next video. Thank you guys. Bye!